Hi, in this video we're going to show you how to resize and replace your images in Microsoft Word. You'll notice by default if you insert an image it tends to stay in line with the text making it kind of hard to position where you want to put it but that's really easy to fix and we're going to show you how to do it. So first of all we're going to insert an image so we go to the insert tab and then pictures. This is Word 2016 so your version might vary so once you pick your picture, we're going to go here, we got a couple ones, picture one. So a nice dog picture there. So you'll notice that, click on it, drag, we can't do anything with it. We could resize it, but if we want to move it around, we can't unless we, you know, oops, delete it like that, which could happen because it was highlighted, or you could hit enter and try and move it down and back, or delete backspace to get it back up. So what you want to do is, click on the picture to highlight it actually double click that might work better for you and then you'll notice it takes you to the picture editing or the formatting tab and what you want to do is click on this position here and instead of the text wrapping ones which is going to kind of show you what it's going to do we're going to go with more layout options and then on the text wrapping tab here you notice the default is in line with text and that's not what we want so what you want to pick is either behind text or in front of text depending on if you're going to be putting text on top of the picture or not. If you're just trying to move it around out of the text area then either one's fine. So I usually just do in front of text and click OK and now you notice that we can move the picture around nice and freely and it doesn't affect where our text is. You know we could just kind of still keep it aligned using the enter key there or start typing and it just goes right over it. Notice that because we set it to put the picture in front of the text. So if we were to go back now and go back to position, layout options, text wrapping, behind text and click OK, you'll notice that the text is now in front of the image there. And then you could also, you know, go down and if you want to insert a new image, do go back to the same thing. Insert pictures, picture two there. I have our other dog picture. And you notice that this one's in line with the text again. So if we were to go back to the text here and hit enter, it's going to move the picture down. So pretty much just double click, bring up the format tab, position, more layout options, text wrapping, we'll click behind text for this one, click OK. And now both of them are freely movable about the screen. Pretty simple. And that's it for this tip. Thanks for watching.